everyone. Today we're going to take a look at some Transformers Bot Bots. This is from Series 5. I've got uh, five of them to take a look at today. Now I picked up these recently the other day and uh, it's been a while since I've taken a look at any of these uh, Bot Bots. Now I've checked the backs of them so I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get any duplicates. Um, although they've all got numbers on them, I haven't checked to see which ones they are, so it's going to be a bit of a surprise seeing which ones we've got. I picked them up at Tesco, and believe it or not, they had them reduced, so they were uh, super cheap, so it's something like um, £1 or £1.15, and then normally £3, so got myself a bit of a bargain there. Let's uh, take a look at these guys. Um, they're all the same. You've got the kind of packaging around here. Normally the colour states which wave it's from but if not it's got it written on the side here series five and it's, it's um not, is that how many figures are in the collection i'm not sure not sure but um let's uh, take a little look and this one it just says at the top number the number it is so let's say that just yet so see i noticed with these later ones that uh they make them a little bit harder to get into, um, which I think is a, a bit of a ploy to stop kids um, or adults even opening them up and seeing who's inside them or swapping around. See who we got here. So what's this? Is that a lampshade? Let's open this up. See who we've got. quite good these because they show you all the different characters that are in the series here you get uh, what's his name where's, where is he they not show who he is anymore ah so he's one of these ones one of the home rangers so he is uh, this one here uh, glam glam fancy flare so he's got one star next to him so what does that mean does he mean he's a rare one uh oh that means he's a common one <laughs> so so but i don't know what the red um tick box is um i don't know but uh yeah he's a common one so he's uh basically like a, a lamp it looks like like that and then you kind of open him up it looks like to transform him Kind of got a weird looking head there, isn't he? And uh, looks like pull out his legs and everything else like that. Got his arms out to the side here, Ugh. like that. And uh, yeah, not sure what you do with these back pieces. It kind of on the on the thing there, it kind of has them up like that. In fact, I think this bit's supposed to be down, and it's the other bit's supposed to be up in its um, other mode so the arms kind of out like that yeah so a bit of a, a weird one that one but uh, not not uh, we focus not bad not bad so pop them off to the side let's see if we can open this one Might have to uh, get the scissors in just to help open this one. Just make a bit of a hole in it. Who have we got in here? So this guy here, what's, what is he supposed to be? Like a radio or something like that? Again, he's got, uh, I think they've all got the same... bit of paper in there that one's actually kind of tied up something so let's see who this guy is so he'll be on here somewhere ah so skippy dippy disc and he's one of the retro plays so that's his mode there and then transform you you just kind of fold the legs out it looks like and move his weird little 
arms out. Oh, sorry. Like that. So that is him. <sighs> Not sure if he looks like like a beefcake or if he's like really worried. But uh, I quite like that one. It's uh, pretty cool. Uh, next up, let's uh, take a look at the next one. Yeah, really make it difficult to get into these. These have like a little perforated line. Ah, no, I think I've got that one. So that one is... Where is he? Lightweight. So he's from the cardio click. Click. And he just opens up like that. It's supposed to be like a weight thing. His legs kind of open up like that. Um, then I think, does this bit go back? Yeah, I'm not sure about this bit here, if it's supposed to go back like that or if it's supposed to stay like that. Yeah, not sure. Not sure about this bit, if it's supposed to go backwards or forwards. Not super clear. But uh, that's that one there. He's a uh, quite cool little one. Not sure. If, yeah, they didn't have the instructions with these ones anymore. Um, previously, you used to have like the instructions for that one, and then pictures of all the rest, which is quite good in the way they kind of cut down on the um, sort of extra packaging and stuff for those ones. So it was quite good. Um, so I've got two more to do to take a look at. Let's open this guy up, see who we've got. Okay, um, oh, I'm not sure if I've got this one. If I do, it's kind of like a repaint of one. So, which line is he from? He is from the Science Alliance group. And he is a Dr. Flicker. So he's kind of like this, almost like a Bunsen burner type of thing. Um, some nice paint on him actually. Oh, it's a, a lady and she, uh, this bit opens up and looks like it's gonna, she's gonna be on like tank treads. It looks pretty cool actually. This arm open out from the side here. Yeah, the arm opens out from the side and this bit kind of swivels around as well. Yeah, that's probably, I don't know if that'll focus, that's probably my favorite one so far out of this, uh, this group. That's, uh, in fact, that's probably one of the better bot bots, I think. That's really cool. I love the face on it. Uh, it's really well done. The nice paint on the top, the arms, the tank, the kind of like wheels and stuff. Really cool. I really like that one. Well worth getting hold of. And let's have a look. We've got uh, the last one. Right, we've got here it's another one of these kind of drink ones so let's see who this one is so do 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 not on that side on this side here where is it super bubs so that's that one again He's a common one. I don't know if all the ones I've got. Lightweight's common. Glam Glam's common. That one's common. Yeah, so uh, this one. Yeah, also common. So all of the ones I've got in this set have been common. Uh, I might go back and um, be armed this time with all the codes and just pick, <laughs> pick out the ones that I want. I might do that tomorrow. And then I can always do another video review. Uh, and this one opens up. How uh, the arms come out. So this is one that um, they've kind of redone a few times with just kind of different 
there's different figures, but it's the same sort of thing, like a drink that opens up. Ah, here we go. Sometimes I find the arms and things on these ones a little bit tricky to pull out. Um, I kind of think to myself, you know, how do like kids and stuff manage to pull them out? But uh, there he is, that's that one there. So I'll show you all of them together. So we've got, uh, got this one here. We've got uh, the kind of white one as well. So we've got, um, we've got one from the um, drinks one. So this one is from the Hibachi Heats. We've got that one there. This one is from the Cardio Click. 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 Uh, this one is from the Science Alliance. Um, and this one is from the Retro Replays. So I put them where you can't see them. And this one is from the Retro Replays. And then this one here is from the Home Rangers. This one's probably my least favourite because it doesn't really look like much when he's in this mode. I suppose if we get him into the kind of lampshade kind of mode. I think perhaps he'll change my mind in that mode. He looks a little bit better, I suppose. Yeah, it's not too bad, but it's not really much to write home about. Um, yeah, it's a pretty cool looking set. Um, I have to say, really, this one here is probably the favorite out of the bunch. Um, I do like this guy, but I'm sure I've got him already. Anyway, I can't remember how it goes with it's like that. It's still pretty cool looking. Uh, this one's pretty nice as well. First time I've got this mold. Um, so I think out of the ones out of here, these two are the few two kind of unique molds that I haven't got before. And the other ones are kind of like repaints and stuff like that. Anyway, that's it for now, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.